This is Keisha here at TradeWithResolve.com and this will be a tutorial video on the Ninja Trader platform. Are you new to the channel or interested in platform tutorials, learning basic trading terminology, or viewing live day trades, then please consider subscribing to the channel. Let's begin with a quick overview of the Ninja Trader Control Center window. So here at the bottom, we have the control center, and this is where you are able to access different windows. So we have new tools, workspaces, connections, and help. And if you select help, you can actually email tech support right from the platform. So if you ever have any questions on how to connect your license key, or how to use a specific feature within the platform, you can email support directly within this platform and they will respond relatively promptly. All right, so let's start out by looking here within the control center. So here we have a number of columns and you can actually customize these columns. So let's right click on a column and then we can select properties. So let's say we want to add another column. For example, let's say I want to add the position column. So you can select position and click apply. So now the position column has been added. Let's say we would like to change the order of the column. You simply drag and you can change the order of the columns. So let's go back, let's right click, select properties. Let's say we want to remove a column. Again, let's just go back to the position column. So you just deselect position, select apply, and the position column has been removed. So that is how you can manipulate the columns and arrange them to your liking. Also, if you would like to view specific tabs and have them handy for immediate access, you can add a new tab here. So let's just click on the plus sign and let's add a positions tab. All right, so now we have an accounts tab and then a positions tab. If you would like to change the order, just simply drag and drop. And now we have the positions tab being displayed first and then the accounts tab. So again, within each tab, you can change the columns by right clicking and selecting properties. Whatever you would like to display, you can go through, select the columns you would like to have displayed, select apply and okay. So that concludes the control center window overview. Next up, we will discuss how to set up the Superdome. Thank you so much for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.